Hi, I'm Minister Ralph Friedrichs. Making a difference is my belief. Here's my challenge to everyone. I just want to challenge everyone, a challenge I'm also trying to live out. No matter how busy you are, there is always something you can do to brighten someone's day. Give someone a hug. Send a text with an inspiring quote. Friends, mail a heartfelt card. Tell someone how much you appreciate him or her. If we look each day presents us with opportunities to share kindness throughout the world, my core belief is that we are called to not only love God and love people, but to carry out the Great Commission and share the eternal message of Jesus Christ. My goal is to help you reimagine your life and let go of the thoughts and behaviors that undermine you so that a renewed and fulfilled you can emerge starting today. We must love one another as God loves each and every one of us. To be able to love, we, my friends, need a clean heart. Prayer is what gives us a clean heart. The fruit of prayer is deepening of faith, and the fruit of faith is love. I hope each and every one of you remember to show compassion and have a, a great life ahead of you with Jesus Christ. Good morning. My name is Ralph Riggs. I'm an addiction recovery coach, life coach, host, minister, and a host of this show, To Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube under channel, Take Your Life Back Today show. Are you using your time wisely? Well, for what is your life? It is even a vapor that uh, appareth for a little time and then vanish away. And that's in James 4, 14. (laughs) Nothing takes God by surprise. Believe me, everything is moving according to his plan, and God wants you in that plan. The devil also has a plan for you in this world. God has a plan, and the devil has a plan, and you will have to decide which plan you're going to fit into your life. Scripture says that God allows us 70 years and some beyond. The first 15 are spent in childhood and early adolescence. 20 years are spent in bed, and in the last five, physical limitation starts to curtail our activities. That gives us about 30 years in which to live as adults. We take time out for eating and for figuring out taxes, and we are down to perhaps 15 years left. Now, suppose we spend seven of those years um, watching television. That cuts us down to seven or eight years left. Our time is short. Time we can invest for God in creative things in reaching our fellow man for Christ is short. Seven years. Think about that, my friends. Each hour of every day is left with this earthly life. I would spend serving you, Lord Jesus, each and every day that I can. Forgive the time spent so often in needless uh, activities that I might spend To this day, I promise you, Lord, to follow, ask you for guidance and directions. Call me at 844-405-HELP. Together, you and I, we can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves and always be good to each other. Remember, simple smile to anyone can change their day and their life and make a difference in your life. Don't waste your time because time is very limited here on earth. Follow Jesus Christ and ask for guidance and direction. May God bless you. Take care.